I shall not be a candidate for re-election. When Harry Byrd Jr. announced last fall that he would not try for a fourth term in the U.S. Senate, everyone took him at his word. Everyone, that is, but several of his longtime conservative allies. Those supporters are not enamored with the likely Republican nominee, Paul Tribble. They are wary of the first district congressman's young age and ambitious nature. So wary that in Richmond last Friday, they revealed plans to conduct a petition drive to get Byrd's name on the November ballot. An effort the senator is not encouraging or discouraging. 11,000 names are needed on these forms by next Tuesday. And the speculation is that Senator Byrd will wait until the sign-up effort is completed to decide whether he really wants to run or not. I don't think that he will. Second District Congressman G. William Whitehurst is among those who doesn't think Byrd will run. I th just think on the basis of what he said in the past, and I hope that I know him well enough uh, to believe that uh, I'm a, a good judge of him, and I, uh, I don't, just don't think he'll do it. Whitehurst, who is honorary state chairman for Tribble, believes his candidate would defeat Byrd and whoever the Democrats nominates. But other political experts are saying Byrd's entry in the race would all but deliver the November election to the Democrats. Tribble supporters hope Byrd thinks about that as he weighs his political future. Joel Rubin, The Daily News.